endured for more than a year puts renewed importance on mental health services. And now, as Chris Schuler reports, those who need help will find some caring experts at the new Brown County Crisis Center. On the campus of the Brown County Community Treatment Center, a crisis center has been built. It's definitely very innovative. It's progressive. We are on the, the front end. A one stop shop aimed at providing the best quality of mental health care for those in distress. Provides the individual who's going through the crisis stabilization quickly so that they can begin the recovery sooner. This 4,000 square foot crisis center can offer fast and efficient care because under its roof are teams of mental health experts committed to streamlining the process. This is so important because in the past we've had service provision at multiple locations throughout the community. The person can go from assessment at the crisis center all the way through the process and never set foot outside. It's full of light. It's Jenny Yonk is one of 25 family services employees who've moved into this facility to work hand in hand with county providers. She says in the past, law enforcement could have spent hours trying to help a person in distress. Now they just need to be brought here. Less time off the street for an officer, less trauma for the patient. They won't necessarily have to get in the back of a squad car to go to an emergency room for medical clearance before then getting back in a squad car to go to another facility for their mental health treatment. From assessment to medical screening to a course of treatment, all under one roof. All the communication will happen in house from our team to the next team. So, very important, according to these experts, as the anxiety, fear, and isolation of the pandemic gradually plays out. I think we're going to see the long term effects of COVID really impact us for many, many years. In Green Bay, Chris Schuler, Local 5 News. Thanks, Chris. Last year in Brown County, 21,000 people called the Crisis Center hotline for help. Happening in Green Bay.